What's going on guys? It's your boy Frank back at it again with a Neverwinter video. Uh, this video here we're going to talk about the new Expedition Pack coming out in Mod 15. Uh, the Consult Expedition Pack is what it's called. Um, just like every other module, this one is going to bring you a pack at the beginning so you can buy it to help you speed up the, the progress and unlocking everything for the complete campaign. Uh, this has just been released now. So this post is gonna be a lot different than the other ones that people have made because it's not broke down. A lot of it's in the dialogue here. So uh, we're gonna get into this one. We're gonna talk about it and tell you what is to be expected in the consult exhibition pack. All right, so uh, t -t 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 -t, we're not gonna read a lot. This top part is basically just dialogue, some lore. Um, we're not going to read through all of it, this part here, particularly. Because, again, this is just lower for the, the most part. So, uh, the first thing that's on this is the tutor. Unlike the other companions, this is not granting you extra currencies like the tiger and like the other modules companion. This active bonus, at the start of the combat, your armor penetration is increased by 5% for 25 seconds. Um... It doesn't tell you a lot about the uh, powers here. I'm sure most of these are powers that are already on other companions. We're not going to get into that. Um, we're just going to go off the base here. And the active bonus is okay if you're really struggling for armor pen. But there's way to, uh, to gain extra armor pen over a companion. So it gives you offense, defense, offense. And the Items is a sword knot, waist, and ring. So me, the companion is not going to be very viable. But if you're struggling with armor pen, especially lower levels, maybe this is a good way to start it. Uh, I know in game it's all about mid maxing, and uh, most of us are already at our percentage that we need to hit for mod 14. So uh, with that being said, we're going to go straight down the list here. That is the tutor, and that is the companion that comes in the exhibition pack. These exhibition packs normally are 10,000 zen, but are normally on sale at the beginning of each module for 7,500. Uh, so you get 25% off. So 7,500 zen is a lot, though. So, uh, especially if you're just starting. So, uh, that is that part. We're going to continue down. Uh, just like the other packs that have came out in the previous modules this is offering you bonus things for getting it should you wish my assistance I have much that I can bring to the table as they say I'm offering a signing bonus by accepting the tutoring contract a fine reward of coalescent wards which is probably five and blood rubies which is probably 20 like it's been as well as benefits for VIP which is normally 30 days the reason for such considerate bonuses that have standards for my business and students. As such, I will be supplying you with a title of business consultant and a proper attire for your dignified title. So these are going to be fashion sets, I'm assuming. Uh, a nice little fashion set to go along with the Mod 15 bundle. So, like, just like previous videos, just like previous packs, this is giving you Coalescent Awards, Blood Rubies, VIP. Um, so, the VIP, normally, again, it doesn't state in this post. Normally, it gives you five Coalescent Awards in VIP. So, right there, just for the Coalescent Awards and the VIP is 6,000 Zen. The Blood Rubies are normally non-bound, so you can resell those. And the Coalescent Awards are normally non-bound, so you can resell those, too. But again, it doesn't specify here. So uh, take that as you will. Normally it specifies all that stuff. It breaks down everything. Um, but this post hasn't. And this is a big thing. This is probably what I'm excited most about the pack. Okay. Once the pack arrives, you'll be able to claim at the rewards claim maintenance. This pack should have unique campaign currencies and acquisition incorporated uses as well as a pack of magical items which is normally transmods 
lockbox keys, and finally some hairstyle manuals. As stated before, I do require my business students to look at my standard. So uh, I'm excited about the new hairstyles. I don't know why. Uh, most of my characters have helmets on, so it really doesn't bother me any. But I like the cosmetic appeal coming to this. Um, I know some of the female characters might want to look into this. The two hairstyles that are shown here and the two guy hairstyles that are shown here. It's something different. So as of right now, this is all the post has. Normally it breaks down how much currency you get and uh, how many uh, what the magical items are, how many lockbox keys, and all that good stuff. So if ARK happens to come out with a future post about this, I will be more than happy to put it out. But as of right now, this is where we're at with it. We are at with the magical items, lockbox keys, the currencies, which is normally 100, and 100 of the lesser value currencies and like 25 of the other ones. So um, hopefully that is where it's at. Uh, as of right now, I will be on the fence whether I get this or not. I got the last one. And uh, I was kind of impressed that this kind of wasn't just because I needed cold wards. So, uh, and I saved up AD for it. If you're not saving up AD and, and spending, you know, a lot of money getting this pack to get a dungeon skirmish that may or may not give you better items is, eh. So, we'll see. As I get more information about what Module 15 brings outside of the uh, acquisition, masterwork, profession, reworking thing, I will let you know. So I'll give you my opinion again when they give you more details about this pack. If you have any questions, I will link this uh, page down below in the comments and or the description section. So you guys can check it out for yourself and hopefully hopefully uh, they bring out something else that is uh, more detailed for what this pack is. So um, that's it. That's all I have to say. If you like the video and if you want to see more content, please subscribe with notifications on so you get the latest news. Um, I've been, I wouldn't say slacking, but I've been indifferent on some of the content I wanted to make. Um, I've definitely been on the fence. But uh, I guess I'm going to push out some content for you guys and I'm going to give you my take and my twist on uh, the content and Mod 15 and any other things you guys want to see. Let me know in the comments below. This is Frank signing out. Peace.